Greetings and salutations to all you folks once again coming to you with Heroes of the Storm. This time I'm going back to a ranged assassin, but a different one. This time we are playing as, I forget her face, Vala. This is the lady with crossbows. I do not have a whole lot of experience with her. I have a basic awareness of her abilities, but not a whole lot. We're going to be discovering together. So we've got reduced manta, mana of Hungering Arrow, and Hungering Arrow returns damage as health. I'm going to do reduced mana, because mana is always a good thing to have more of. Let's go ahead and run up and ambush people as is normal. You turn into a wolf instead of mounting a horse. That is very interesting. Alright. So, let's see. Hungering Arrow... Fires an arrow that splits and strikes again, so three arrows basically can't all hit the same target. Then we've got multi-shot, which is shotgun blast spread shot. And then we've got the vault, which gets you out of harm's way quickly. Alright, we got some pretty good range on here, so that's not a problem. I need to get out from between these two people because that is a dangerous place to be and holy hell, ah, I need to escape. Wow, that was bad. I need to get used to this. Do need to be collecting gems though because gems are what gives you the spider. Actually, I think I played this map already. Yes, it was the last one that I did with you guys. So, uh, no, don't mount. Stupid. Hot key. All right. There we go. I'm gonna get back in the swing of things here. I love people with healing abilities. They're so helpful. Alright. Really need to be careful with what I'm doing here. Sit up, pay attention, game seriously. This is not just a game after all, this is life and death as we all know. Not really. Whatever. Ah, teaming up on these people. I love it when I'm not the person being teamed up on. Let me go turn in the one gem that I have while you people are busy and I'm trying to heal. I feel bad because I'm not really contributing to the team that much. Let me go see if I can ambush this person. Oh crap. No! I died. Let's see. Basic attacks heal me. I'm going to go for that. Because I am having a severe problem with death at the moment. And that is not something that I need to be struggling with. Kurt Cobain struggled with death and lost. And I do not want to end up like he did. Collect them gems. Alright. Get out of the way. I don't want to be in there. <clears throat> Alright, gotta get these gems. Alrighty then. And I'm sure glad the basic attacks heal me because if they did not, I would be dead right now. That is the one bad thing about ranged assassins is that they just do not have the health necessary to hold up to full frontal assaults. The only one that does it so far that I've played as is um oh crap is um rainer the uh soldier dude because he can knock people back away from him that are coming into attack and it works out really really well turn in turn in turn in thankfully he did not come attack me could have ended badly Spiders ahoy! 
Sure hope nobody's scared because there are going to be a lot of them. Oh crap, I forgot to go get the crystals. Let's see here. Um we'll go for that one. Yes, spiders. That's a very disturbing looking person. Just saying. That guy's toying around with the edges of my vision, but he just doesn't quite want to get in. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Whoa, that was close. Should I run to get the gem? Should I get the gem? Should I get the gem? Yes, I'm gonna get the gem. Alrighty then. Got 13 of these things. Yeah, I need to heal. But, why heal when I can kill minions and do the same thing? You took my minions! I'm supposed to kill those. Alright. Let's turn these in, then I'm going to go get a drink out of this sippy cup, because I think that is the... Oh, I didn't finish turning in. That one is recharged. Alright, I tried the Reign of Arrows a little while back um, as an ability, and it was not the most impressive thing ever. There's a very relatively small amount of damage to a huge group of minions, which is nice, but not super awesome. So this is going to give me the ability to actually hit, let's see, launch two waves of Shadow Blast and deal 330 damage to enemies within the target area, and they stun. So let's get in here and use this. Nice. Me likey, me likey. And now I need to get the hell out of dodge. Because this is almost the death of me. I'm just gonna chill here. That health actually does regen really well. Ah, boost. And we got him again. Doing really well if I do say so myself. This is, this lane is going very well. And then the ones in the northern side are going pretty well. After that first death, everything is looking okay. Too bad my heroic ability is not recharged so far. Oh. Mr. Avatar is back on the field. Let's see, let's do slow enemies with frost shot. That uh that sounds like an excellent idea. Meantime I can slow people down. Alrighty. I'm very slowly but surely getting the hang of talking while I'm playing. These first few videos of this I know are gonna be fairly boring. And, uh, I pity the people who actually do watch all of them all the way through. Although I do really appreciate the guys who do. Um, 
That is like the epitome of loyal viewer <laughs> to endure this. But this is basically me hashing my way through learning this game and what all of the different abilities do and how to manipulate the micro and everything else. And then once I start getting up into the, um, once I break rank 30 and I'm actually up with the better guys and I have some people to play with on voice chat and stuff, I'll actually start a playlist and start doing this seriously. Kind of like I do Supreme Commander. Not in the quantity that I do Supreme Commander, but uh, it'll be along the same line, same quality of stuff. Picture yourself being in on the ground level. And for those of you who always ask me about this, no, no, I'm not going to stop casting Supreme Commander. That is still my primary. Three times a week, Supreme Commander is going to be here. It's just that uh, in the between times, I'm going to be doing this for something a little different. And then, of course, when Ashes of the Singularity comes out, that will be a great game to get into, I think. It's one of the few games I've seen recently that has like incredibly massive potential, but they're actually under-hyping it. It was basically a tech demo um, that we saw. I, I forget where it was at. Which uh, convention it was. And they got the Orb Weaver this time. Should have turned in my gems, because I got like 18. I'm going to back up a little ways. Let's see. Deal extra damage to disabled uh, two charges of the vault. I don't have anything that disables people, so extra damage is not going to do me a whole lot of good. Let's do two, two charges of vault, I think is going to be our best bet here. Well, that was actually really nice. Get the regen. And yes, a little help from a teammate. We are good to go on that. See, so banking 20 gems here. I think we can actually, yeah, we can actually trip the, trip the egg. And you can see every time you cash in crystals, the amount goes up. So it does. I'm gonna kill you. You know that. Yup, gotcha. Stuck around too long. Oh crap, I'm about to die too. Holding 21 gems, that would suck. Holy cow, that would be terrible. All right, I did my part. Two more needed. Let's grab a sippy cup and then head back towards the front here. I'm actually completely full on mana. Totally did not need that uh, reduction in mana cost that was happening before. I have a hard time finding the right place to use her abilities. It is it is difficult. The heroic ability is not as blatantly obvious of a useful tool as some of the other ones that I've had. More accurately, I keep forgetting that I have it because it's not super duper special. Let me do this. I think I was winging the side with that. Maybe. Maybe just a little. Yeah. Execution. Yeah. And this is going to be fast. Wow. I'm going to kill the entire enemy team. Holy cow. That was brutal. 13 minute game. I think that officially qualifies as rape. <laughs> <laughs> Not in the literal sense. No, please, no one climb down my throat for that comment. Oh, my goodness. All right, that is the end of that match. I'm going to get out of you guys' hair.
with this game. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully you will stick around for more videos to come. As always, thank you so much for watching and do not forget to tune in tomorrow for a new Supreme Commander cast and then on Saturday, 6 p.m. United States Eastern Time is the live cast that I do every Saturday for Supreme Commander. Definitely want to jump in on that one. We have a fantastic time. Hit up the YouTube channel and you will see where it's advertised starting Friday night. All right, guys, I'm out of here. See you in the next video.